The pavement management team is always looking to better Charleston County roads. And when titanium dioxide became available, the county decided to do a pilot program. Titanium dioxide is a photocatalyst. The photocatalyst actually, when UV light, sunlight hits the roadway, it excites an electron. The, uh, the electron jumps up above the roadway and begins to break down pollutants. So it breaks down the uh, tailpipe emissions, volatile organics, molds, viruses, those sort of things. Um, in addition, it's actually going to help reduce the heat island. We began the pilot program in the Rosemont and Union Heights communities and a small section of the medical district. So Charleston County Public Works selected this neighborhood because it's located in the neck of Charleston, um, which is right along the I-26 corridor. Um, and they have the greatest risk of air pollution being next to this corridor. That, and we felt that the pilot project would have the greatest benefit to this community. The city of Charleston and Berkeley Dorchester Charleston Council of Governments were also involved in this project. Charleston County has been an amazing partner with the city of Charleston for many years. And when they approached us about the titanium oxide project, uh, we decided we had to jump on board as quickly as possible. We knew it would be a, a great benefit to the city and the local community as well. And uh, the local community is a historical underserved community called Rosemont. Uh, and Rosemont, the collaboration that took place with them, with the county, uh, was just amazing. Charleston County did an amazing job working with us ahead of time before the implementation. The history of surface transportation development along I-26 has really negatively impacted the communities that were, that were there before I-26, especially the Rosemont neighborhood. So being able to track research that tests the before and after effects of air quality change is great. An additional benefit of being able to shoehorn an air quality project like this into ongoing pavement preservation as a, an added benefit that it could be scalable for the whole region. Road cores were taken from the Rosemont community before and after they were treated with titanium dioxide and sent to Texas A&M Transportation Institute for testing. Results showed that the titanium dioxide had a 39% reduction in the chemicals produced by vehicles. That means the road is actually oxidizing these harmful emissions, reducing ozone pollution and mitigating the formation of acid rain while cleaning the air for residents. Data also showed the treated roads increase solar reflectiveness, which lowers the heat island effect. Our project was about 40% more emissive than U.S. Green Building Council lead and American Public Works Association ISI envision requirements and four times at displacing heat energy back into the atmosphere compared to untreated sections of pavement. While the pilot was a small area compared to the total number of roads Charleston County maintains, this new technology could one day affect the entire Charleston population.